Okay, we will dis. Hi. Um, today we will discuss top down and bottom up approach in the stock market. Welcome to the free financial literacy series course. This channel is free and available. Hai. And in fundamental analysis, there are two types of approach. Hote hai. And we will discuss what is the best for you, what are pros and cons, hai. and in may like differences. Kya hai. Okay, so the first thing is top down approach. In this, we will see that we have to invest in which country we have to invest in which economy we have to invest in. For example, the US. Ho gaya. India हो गया. US एक developed country है. उनमें इतना you know growth का इतना chance नहीं है. पर India एक बहुत ही developing country है. Growth का बहुत chance है वे बहुत ज़्यादा right. So हम पहले country देखते कि ज़्यादा growth opportunities कहाँ पे हैं. So India में हो गए इस case में. ठीक है. The second thing we look at is sector. तो किस sector में um, better होगा? For example last year pandemic में हमें पता चल गया था कि घर तो घर पे रहने वाले हैं. So, you know, formal clothes, normal t shirt and shorts, people will not use their hands, So, FMC sector will take a rise, and the casual clothes sector will take a rise, right? So, this is the current trend of the sector. Similarly, last year, we had told that the hotel and management and restaurants sector it will take a hit. Bali you McDonald's or KFC, ho, but you will take a hit. And then, we will see companies honge, jo top leaders honge generally. We will see their you know, fundamentals kaise hai, and, and then we will invest. For example, India is a country which is growing at about 8 to 9 percent year on year. Suppose a sector is growing at 15 to 20 percent. So, the sector is growing at 15 to 20 percent. The sector ya market leaders kam se kam 15-20 percent se to grow kar hi rahe honge in fact usse zyada se grow kar rahe honge so that is top down approach ab is ye kin log ke liye hota hai jo thode market mein naye hai aur jinko itna knowledge nahi hai ya fir jo itne experience nahi hai aur itna time nahi de sakte for market research isme problem ye hoti hai ki ek koi niche ek koi chote sector mein ek gold mine ho ek multi bagger ho hum usko miss kar sakte hain to main achhi companies bilkul mil jayengi but in a gold mine, maybe you can miss out on it. Now we come to the bottom up approach. The bottom up approach is how the financials of a company are. There are ratios and etc. And we do the whole fundamental analysis first. Okay. After that, we see how the sector is. Is there a growth in the sector or not? Because the company is so good in a deep sector, the sector is so good in a good sector. It is very difficult to survive. And this is also true in a very rising sector. A tech company is also अच्छा कर ले दिए, right? तो उस सेक्टर के ट्रेंड्स कैसे हैं, वो सेक्टर कैसे आगे जाके यू नो फॉर्म होने वाला है। And third thing we look at is macroeconomic factors या कंट्री का यू नो इकोनॉमी कैसे चल रही है, क्या-क्या ट्रेंड्स हैं, क्या-क्या यू नो साइकल्स हैं वगैरह वगैरह। अब इसके लिए आपको चाहिए टाइम एंड नॉलेज। But I think the time and knowledge will be worth the effort because आपको यहाँ पे multi baggers मिलने का chance ज़्यादा है। पर अब problem पता है इसमें क्या है? यहाँ पे हो सकता है कि कितने 15-16 companies listed हैं। So हर एक company को बैठकर fundamentally analyze करें कैसे possible है वो। यहाँ पे आते हैं stock screeners, ticker tape है, ticker by phenology है, काफी सारे हैं। मैं personally ticker tape use करता हूँ। So you can actually screen the stocks from for your requirement. For example, आपको P/E ratio आपको 50 से कम का ही चाहिए, तो आप वो कंडीशन लगा सकते हैं एंड ऐसे वैसे वैसे आ जाएगा। अब यू नीड टू डिसाइड व्हाट्स बेस्ट फॉर यू। अगर आप थोड़े यू नो मार्केट में नए हैं, इफ आपको अगर इतनी नॉलेज नहीं है, सो द टॉप डाउन अप्रोच इज एक्चुअली बेटर फॉर यू। टिल यू गेट यू नो फॉर्मिलियर विथ अ लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स यू लर्न अ लॉट ऑफ � Please like and subscribe because the whole financial literacy series is part of the whole playlist of financial literacy. So that is the one here, which is ongoing as of now. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.